good day in the name of Jesus, our blessed Lord and Savior. Uh, after careful deliberation and consideration about the ongoing coronavirus, we have uh, come to the need to obey government uh, instructions and recommendations, in particular about uh, safe distancing and the need to limit the number of people in, in, in our gathering to 10. So to comply with that, as we're supposed to, you know, not that we we'll lack faith, but uh, to use wisdom, what we have done is uh, employ online technology for the rest of this month. And what that means, therefore, is that um, we are going forward, going to be having online services, which means uh, there will be no uh, gathering for two weeks. So all our Bible studies, prayer meetings and Sunday services will all be online. So we encourage you to get someone to help you to make sure you can log on and be a part of all these activities uh, pending when the situation changes for the better to the glory of God. So our Bible study, uh, our Sunday service, all of that will be online and uh, we also want you to know that there will be no house fellowship if the house fellowship is more than 10 uh, but if you are less than 10 go ahead and have your house fellowship there will be no sunday school for the next two weeks uh, until the situation changes uh, i wanted to know that you can do all your giving whether it's your tithes whether it's your offering or any other whatever you the lord lays on your heart to be a blessing to the church financially you can do that online it's very safe you can also employ regular mail if you want to mail in your uh, the donations to the church and we'll keep proper record of that. Lastly, I want to say I decree that you will not be a victim of coronavirus in the name of Jesus uh, because you are blessed and highly favored. You stay fit in the Lord. We'll be getting more information out to different groups through uh, the different uh, groups like, like uh, women's, like men, like workers so forth. Just stay uh, abreast with whatever uh, we're sending your way. Shalom.